All right, good evening. Today we have a uh, New England IPA from, I think it's uh, Spearhead Brewing Company in Kingston, Ontario, Canada. It's a strong beer, coming in at 7%. Uh, I think it's called Nipa, Nepa, Niepa. I don't know. It's the initials of New England IPA. So, a fancy can, nice lighthouse on there. We're gonna give it a try. Well, I'm gonna give it a try. Right off the bat, I can tell you it sounds good. It's looking good, nice golden color. A little bit of forehead on it. Good aroma. Very good, got a little bit of bite to it. All right. I don't know, I'd say maybe a strong beer, strong joke. This guy uh, wanders into a bar one night, he sees a nice looking lady sitting up at the bar by her self and he uh, thinks I'm gonna I'm gonna approach her so he does he walks right up to her and he says excuse me miss so I, I noticed you as soon as I come in the bar and uh, yeah I'd like to uh, take you out to my car and uh, have sex with you she's kind of taken back this guy's pretty forward and uh, she says actually no I don't think that's gonna happen my uh, my boyfriend He's a very strong man. He's a rather large man. He's uh, actually in the washroom right now. And uh, he'll be back any second and he sure would not appreciate that. And the guy, undeterred, says, uh, well, you know what, uh, I'm gonna grab a beer. I'm gonna go sit in that booth over there. And if you change your mind, you know where to find me. So she says, uh, yeah, just uh, move along. So he grabs a beer. Goes and sits in his booth, he drinks his beer, no boyfriend yet. So he thinks, I gotta go up to the bar anyways, I'm gonna try again. So he goes off to the same girl, and he says, I see uh, your boyfriend hasn't returned yet, so maybe, uh, what do you think, you and me? Uh, we'll go to my car, I'll flip you upside down, fill your pussy full of beer, and drink it. She's like, what? What are you talking about? Like. My boyfriend will definitely not like that. I wouldn't like that. I'm pretty sure he wouldn't like that. He's a strong, strong man. He'd be out of the bathroom any second now. And I, if I were you, I'd just leave now. And the guy says, well, same as before. I'm gonna get a beer, and I'm gonna be sitting in that booth right over there. If you change your mind, come let me know. So the, uh, <clears throat> sure enough, Couple minutes, he grabs his beer, sits down in the booth, but a couple minutes later, this huge dude walks out of the bathroom, like just massive hulking man, like strong man, probably win the strong man competition. And uh, he comes over and sits right on the bar stool beside this lady, and she starts talking to him. He says, hey, you see that guy over there? Yeah, what about him? Well, he said he wanted to take me out to his car and have sex with him. Oh, really? Stands up, starts taking off his shirt. So what else did he have to say? Well, as a matter of fact, he said he wanted to turn me upside down, fill my pussy full of beer and drink it. Can you believe that? And uh, this big guy, he's like, whoa, starts putting his shirt back on and he's sitting back down. She's like, well, aren't you gonna go beat the crap out of him? Like, that's a pretty forward of that guy. I told him I had a boyfriend and everything. Like, and uh, the guy says, well, I wouldn't mess with anyone that could drink that much beer. Beer and a joke. 